When you look at the world and you look at India and the US and the curve of the virus, what are you seeing? What gives you hope and what worries you? Well, in America, things are going extremely well after a very difficult time we had last fall and winter. The number of cases are going down considerably. Our, we went from a daily average of about 60,000 a day to now well below 20,000 a day. The good news is that we are doing very well with the implementation of vaccines. About 52% of our adult population is fully vaccinated and about 64% of our adult population has received at least one dose of a two dose regimen. The rest of the world, it really is depends on what country you're talking about. Some countries are doing well. I mean, the UK is now facing a problem with the 617 Delta variant, the variant that is dominant in India, that is becoming the dominant variant in the UK. So even though they've done very well with their vaccine program, they are concerned about the reemergence of the variant 617. India had gotten hit very badly, as you well know, but the cases are starting to come down, at least in certain states. So it really is a mixed bag. Some countries are doing well. Some countries, for example, several countries in South America are having a real difficulty. The most important thing for everyone is to get as many vaccines into people's arms as quickly as you possibly can. And that's the thing that's going to ultimately contain the outbreak. It's going to be vaccination. So we've got to get people all over the world vaccinated. President Biden yesterday at the G7 announced that the United States will be giving to other low and middle income countries 500 million doses of vaccines, which is the largest donation of vaccines literally in history.